welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my finished 7 by spring update number 2. Um, in my January update, I hadn't finished any products, but I'm happy to report that I've actually finished 4 out of the 7 products that I chose for this project. So I'm going to show you the products I finished first, and then um, I'll show you the ones that I'm still making progress on. So the first product was the um, Bath and Body Works Antibacterial Hand Lotion in Midnight Pomegranate, which is this product here. Um, I have my marks on this side here, so I was originally there, I moved here, and then I finished this product. So I'm so happy to actually have used up a hand cream. I think this is probably the first one I've ever used up in my entire life without losing it first. Um, and I'm glad that I got my money's worth and I can move on and try other hand creams. The next product that I um, finished was in my NYX Love & Rio eyeshadow trio. And it was this center shade right here, which I know you can't see, but here's the pretty pan. Um, and it was a champagne, <coughs> excuse me, it was a champagne kind of color. And I finished this not long after my January update. And I'm going to throw this trio away. That dark color, I really, um, the dark brown, I really just don't like the formula of it. So I'm going to call that done. The next product I finished is the Pixi Flawless Beauty Primer. Um, I received this in an Ipsy bag, and my marks were on the back here, so I was here, here, and then I finished it. So I'm happy to be done with this. I would not repurchase this. I'm just glad it's out of my collection. So the last product I finished up is the Revlon Color Burst Lip Butter in the shade 025 Peach Parfait. So this is it here, rolled all the way up. And I am so happy to have finished my first lipstick ever. And this is going towards um, the 10 lip products that I want to finish um, in 2015. So the three products that I'm still working on finishing are this Clinique um, lip liner in the shade 07 Plush Pink. So I've been making pretty good progress on this. Um, the pencil is now the same size, um, maybe a little bit shorter than the cap. And I don't think I'm going to be able to finish it in a month's time, but any products that I have left over from Finish 7 by Spring, I'm actually going to roll them into um, my Finish 5 by Cinco de Mayo and see if that extra, you know, five or six weeks or whatever will help me to actually finish the products completely. The next product I am still not done with is the uh, Mary Kay Eye Primer. Um, so there were my updates, the first one there, and then the second one here. And I know there's still some left. I'm thinking I can finish it before March 20th, though. Um, so I'm going to give it my best shot. And the last product that just, I just can't, <laughs> is um, this Mary Kay blush right here. So the pan spot is larger. I pretty much use this on a daily basis. Um... But blush is just taking so long to finish, and I have like at least like 20 blushes, so it's kind of depressing. And I've been working on finishing this blush for at least like six months. I will use other blushes occasionally, but still this is my main blush. So that's kind of discouraging as far as um, trying to use up my blush stash. So that was my Finish 7 by Spring update, and if you guys are doing a project like this, please let me know, and I'll come check out your video. I can't believe that it's already, um, you know, a couple weeks into February here, and we're almost entering March. Time is really going quite quickly this year, um, but I feel that I'm pretty pleased with the progress that I've made on these products that I've selected. So thanks for watching, and have a good day. Bye!